Hi. Hello, are you there? Okay. <laughs> uh, yes, I am. Nice to hear Hello. you. Hello. Hello. Hi, Piotr. Hi. Uh, and and uh, how are you? I'm good. Yeah, it's rainy here. Uh oh. How here about I you? Have, yeah, here I have a sunny day. You know, it's really, really great weather. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I'm reading about you in this flyer. So you're having a performance, uh, and it's a bit. Uh, it has some technical uh, challenges. Uh, how is that? Did that work? Could you explain it to me? Yes, I'm. I, I will explain it during the the whole process. So I start. Right. By, yeah, uh, it's more. Uh, performance than the music piece. Uh, mm -hmm. So uh, during this process, uh, we will hear more and more sounds. And I, w w when I finish explaining, we stay with the music for a while. Perfect. Yeah, so uh, when the music uh, is over, I will stay here a little longer and we can talk. And you know, I I'm happy to answer any question. <laughs> Thank you, so, I would gladly talk after that. Yeah, so uh, uh, we, we we can start if you if you want. Yeah. Yes, please. Let's start. Okay. So. Here I have a cheap USB microscope, which is actually a kind of camera connected to my computer. I have also here a women's blouse, which is a part of an Ukrainian national suit. On my screen, I can see a square of little piece of fabric magnifying by the microscope. Now I'm taking one vertical strip of pixels from the picture, just one column through the whole square. I'm interested of brightness value of each of these pixels. I'm making a special curve shape from it. When the brightness of some pixels is high, my curve goes up. And when the brightness of the next pixel is darker, my curve goes down. Program is making it in real time. The curve now, now starts to be a profile of a digital filter. By this filter, I'm passing a white noise so this profile is shaping the noise. White noise is electronic made. It contains every frequency hearable in equal amount. When I'm start to moving lens of my microscope by the surface of this beautiful hand embroidered woman's blues, in fact, I'm curving the noise by this filter profile, which is still morphing based on the spot the microscope watch. This kind of sound synthesis I'm making here, we can call a subtractive spectral synthesis. Every time I like the picture from my microscope view, I can take a photo and save it in a special folder. I can use this photo later to make an, another type of sound synthesis called wavetable synthesis. Now I'm taking an instrument specially designed for it. It's called Serum.
the instrument converts the picture uh, to a three-dimensional landscape in a special way. It takes the brighter parts of it and transforms it to a mountains and the darker parts to a valleys. Uh, I mean, we can scan across this photo. I. Uh, taken picture uh, previously. Now I can scan through the whole landscape and my waveform will morph. In fact, I can take any of its wave profiles to fit every parameter of the sound I want to. Which of it will be depends on my artistic choice. The possibilities are almost endless. The shape of a waveform is determining the timbre of the sound, but the pitch, based on frequency, I need to choose by playing the key on my keyboard. Or I can reuse the beautifully designed Ukrainian blues embroidery I have here. Now I'm using another technique on my microscopic picture. First, I'm decreasing a resolution of the picture significantly. It starts look as a pixel art. Then I'm turning it to the highest contrast possible. The brighter parts turns completely white and darker appears completely black. The picture starts to be a piano roll view of a MIDI sequencer. Every pixel row means certain MIDI pitch value. Now I'm reading the picture from left to right and every white part means no data, but the black pixels act as a MIDI notes.
Now I can send a note information to my previous instrument. This gives me both the melodic and the rhythmic material. I can treat it as a score. Now, uh -huh. yeah, finally, I can record the MIDI data track uh, and use the specific note pitches as new tracks with a new instances of serum with different wave shapes previously prepared from my blues. I can make a whole music arrangement based on nothing but the Ukrainian blues collected data. Okay, thank you. I think it's enough to Hi. present. Yeah. I, I is it, is it uh, over? I'm sorry. I don't want, didn't want to interrupt you. <laughs> yes, yes. I think uh, it's uh, it, it, it will be enough. Uh, mm -hmm. of the it's presentation. Very yeah? Yeah? It was very interesting. Your choice of material to make the sound and have this, let's say, uh, sound interpretation between what you are, your visual and me, and in such a different way. Uh, thank you, a really, really interesting experience and a very creative solution, I love it. Yeah, thank you. Yes, in fact, it's a really visual uh, kind of method, yes, to, to obtaining the sound. So the visual part is uh, really important but instead of this, I uh, I decide to to make this uh, <laughs> uh, description in 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 speech. Yes, so mm -hmm. I hope it's also uh, making some uh, um, some experience to to to, to imagination because uh, when we see something, yeah. 
we we exactly uh, know how it looks like but when we talk about it it's it's stimulate more the the imagination i think yeah it's true uh and this the fact that you are telling the narrating this story let's say this about the noises made me really think um uh, and visualize them in a way i guess i wouldn't um at, uh, just uh, listening, I wouldn't have this, you know, this uh, storytelling. It's very nice that I, it made me think about other uh, weird choices on the materials as well. Yeah. Yeah. Well, thank you, Piotr. This was thank very you. nice of you to play for me. I thank you. Thank you so much. It's uh really nice to have you here <laughs> thanks so have a good day and and you stay too. stay safe <laughs> let's go yeah you too stay safe thank you bye thank you bye <laughs>